Postman Fro with a package for you. Bing bong! <gasps> Anybody in there? I've got your package. It's Postman Fro with a generic package. Yeah! Oh, uh, Postman Fro was here. Oh, he brought me a big box. What is in the box? Well, this is the Epson SC for something something P600. Let's open up this bad boy because I've been waiting for this Epson printer for a long time. We open up the box and we have in here designed without compromise. That means they didn't compromise one iota. Maybe. We'll see. What is in this thing? So we open this up and we have ink. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine ink cartridges. This is liquid gold, by the way. I think it's like $2,000 a gallon. Let's see how they look. You know, they're actually bigger than I expected. I, I thought they would be much thinner, but they're, I think there's 25 milliliters, milliliters of ink, or this is pigment-based ink in here. You've got your power cable. It does not come with a USB cable. It is Wi-Fi, uh, and it is Ethernet connected. I would never print Wi-Fi. What if you lose your connection? You're gonna lose all of that inky stuff that you're gonna do. So we'll move that over here. You have a, a DVD or CD tray. Who in their right mind uses DVDs and CDs anymore to print on these things? I don't, so let's get rid of that. Okay, we got styrofoam, and we have, oh, this looks like a paper feeder, because look, it comes with roll paper. This is roll paper. This is canvas. No, this one is the premium luster photo paper. It is like 13 inches wide by 30 some feet long of printable space, whatever 10 meters is. Maybe it's more than that. I don't know what 10 meters is, but it's something. So that, it does roll printing. 13 inches wide by almost however long you wanna be. Let's get rid of the styrofoam. We got more of that. We do that. Here's the printer. We gotta take it out of the box. Oh, it's not even as heavy as I expected, but it's not bad at all. Shoo, shoo, look at this, look at this. Oh, this is the photographer's workout. You can do this. So here it is. This is the SCP-600. Not too big. Not too small, but the one cool thing that this thing does other than, you know, it is, it's gonna do cool things. It's got lots of blue tape on it, which I'm not gonna open up right now. The fact that it takes roll paper is opening up an entirely new world of possibilities for your printing uh, at home. If you shoot panoramics or you put them together in new Photoshop CC or Lightroom CC, you're gonna get a panoramic that you can print 13 inches by as long as the roll will go. You can print on canvas. Uh, you can print on the luster paper. It comes with all this, well, it doesn't come with the paper, but they sent me metallic photo paper luster, metallic photo paper glossy, hot press bright. Ooh, hot press, you're so amazing. You're so hot right now. Awesome, Hansel. Velvet fine art paper. Ooh, I would print a velvet cupcake on this, because that's what I would do to that. And then we've got the ultra premium photo paper luster. I love luster paper. I'm thinking that this is gonna be the paper for me. But then they also have in here, oh, thank you for sending me the ultra premium photo paper luster in the 13 by 19. I love it. Smells like victory. That's right. This is the Epson P600. I can't wait to put this through the test and do a real world review of it because this is a, this $800 printer. There's two schools of thought. You either do a lot of printing at home because you have a need to do it, or you don't do a lot of printing and that $800 is better spent online at somewhere like Adoramapix getting prints made. There's the two schools of thought. If you're at home and you have to pump out a lot of prints quickly and you're making money and you're selling them or you're giving them away as gifts, then this, you know, we found out that home printers have gotten so much better and they are fantastic as long as you put them to use. If you let them sit there, they're not worth having. If you're going to use them, they're definitely worth having. So I can't wait to check this thing out. Thank you, Postman Fro, for bringing this along with all of this paper. I'm super excited, and we'll leave it at that. Jared Poland, froknowsphoto.com. See ya.
Do you love Postman Fro videos? Well, there are more. Just click over here. It's going to take you to a playlist of Postman Fro videos. But if you like all of my videos, go ahead, hit the subscribe button here on YouTube so you can see more of them as they go live. And don't forget to like it if you are on Facebook. Do something. You got three options. You can click them.